Well, the HST is an, an excellent example to show why the issue of integrity in politics is still alive today. You know, in the last federal election, no federal party talked about the HST. In the spring of 2009, the provincial Liberal Party, my Liberal colleagues, cousins, uh, directly told the people of British Columbia that they would not bring in an HST. Weeks later, what did they do? They brought in an HST. Now, after that, British Columbian MPs had an opportunity to vote on that issue. It started in Ottawa where we amended legislation and we had to vote on whether $1.6 billion would be paid to the province of BC. Often in politics, it's hard to tell what people think. There was no such difficulty with the HST, let me tell you. 80% of British Columbians were opposed to it and they were misled about it to boot. What did the Liberal and Conservative MPs do in Ottawa? They voted for it. Only the NDP stood up for British Columbians and the interests of the people here and voted against the HST in Ottawa because it was a bad tax at a bad time that imposed in increased costs on small businesses and consumers in a recession. It's also regressive because under the guise of harmonizing, it represented a tax increase of 7% on hundreds of everyday items like haircuts and newspapers, restaurant meals, vitamins, children's lessons, and that was not only bad policy, but it was also deceptive. And uh, that's why the New Democrats are the only party with credibility on the issue of the HST. Um, in June, uh, the uh, people of British Columbia is going to be having a, re a referendum on this one. And I know as a uh, citizen of British Columbia, I'm going to be doing my share to be voting as a small business person. Um, I wanted to uh, let every everyone in this room know that uh, I've been a business, small business owner for the last 22 years. And, uh, you know, uh, we uh, as a citizen uh, know, uh, I, I myself as a citizen know how to vote uh, in this referendum with good conscience. And uh, uh, I want to urge everyone to come out and vote uh, to practice your rights uh, and your, um, uh, your conscience. Thank you very much. Thank you.